Greetings, I'm Joe and my wife Kathy is going to demonstrate this new enclosure that we have built. It was a DIY project. First things first, and I need to thank the guys at Tormach uh, at their open house last year. Kathy and I learned so much. And we stopped at the Henry Ford Museum and I saw the tri-motor and I was thinking I wanted to create a, a system uh, that can be used with either arm. I have some issues with my right arm. So this rolls back and forth and I was using corrugated roofing. I'm going to have my wife uh, start the mill in, in a second, and I'm going to have her uh, get it up to 5,000 RPMs. I built a control panel with her help, and we uh, ended up uh, putting some pretty unique controls in there. And it has a drawbar disable uh, circuit now in the machine, so it won't release a tool when this machine is spinning. So we're going to just show this. There's a lot of features that are built into this uh, enclosure. We won't be able to get to all of them, so here we go. Kathy, can you start the mill and run it up? Uh, i got a set of 5,000 RPMs. And it has air doors. we got the doors closed right now. But I want to show you the control panel. And right here we have a, a, a disabled drawbar uh, circuit. And you can see that that green LED is running. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have Kathy step on the, the pedal. And that would be the last thing you'd want to do if you were running your mill at 5,000 RPMs. I know, I did it, and it made a heck of a mess. Okay, so now what I'd like you to do is, is to shut the mill off. We're running Path Pilot. And uh, open the doors, if you would. Okay. You can see the, okay. And of course it, it operates. And it also has some other controls that the uh, different nozzles will go up and down with these handles. And you know, there's a lot of features. It's got a, a cabinet with glass. This all tips back in so everything runs back. Uh, very nice uh, machine. We also uh, mill long extrusions and this cabinet has doors, so it'll allow me to actually run 10-foot uh, extrusions through the, the mill, and I make a 25.4 millimeter clamp. Uh, this is uh, what we do. We, we make walking systems, actually work with a lot of uh, amputees, and Kathy and I really want to bring awareness to uh, what we do. We need to help people, and uh, this is the machine that we uh, bought to uh, do our own uh, design work. I hope you like it. If you do, please let us know. I have a whole bunch of things that I can show you. Uh, this was redesigned real quick. Uh, computer is up in the back of the machine, no longer down on the floor. Uh, of course, the uh, mister that I came up with uh, uh, is uh, mounted back there, and also the electronics. And the way I did it is kind of nice, uh, it's very simple. So everything has been made to work on. Everything comes apart. Very, very nice, very easy with tempered glass. And uh, the Henry Ford tri-motor was really the inspiration I needed to come up with a, this is just metal roofing and it's upside down and uh, the uh, wheels uh, on the track roll back and forth and it just seems to be a perfect marriage of things that you have around the house. Any, any DIYer could do it. Thanks again and uh, we're gonna sign off so, so here you go. Thank you Kathy.